Hey there, everybody. Thomas Will at Basecamp Trading. It is Wednesday, May 8th, and we're going to take a look really quick at another feature that TradeStation has, and that's time and sales. I get a question all the time in the trading room. Hey, Thomas, how do I set up a uh, time and sales window? So the way you do this is very easy. You're going to go to File, go New, Trading App Window, then go to Time and Sales, and that'll pull up time and sales right there. And you can see right here, it's just scanning through them and you're seeing every single trade go through right now this is for the nasdaq so we're seeing lots and lots of orders lots and lots of trades we don't really want to look at every single trade that goes through here right so we want to filter these out now before i explain to you how to filter those out one thing i would like you to do go ahead and hit that a like button just give us a thumbs up that helps us out with the videos also shows that you're appreciating the content also feel free to leave a comment if you have any questions or anything but with that being said, the way that we filter this is we're then going to right click. We'll right click right up here. We'll go format at NQ, which is NASDAQ. We'll do today. Okay. And the thing we want to see here is this right down at the bottom where it says show all trades. We want to check the box that says show trades greater than or equal to. And then we'll say for the NASDAQ 20 shares or 20 contracts or more. So therefore it will only see if a trade is placed with 20 contracts or greater. And then we hit okay. <clears throat> and now it will only start showing us trades here if there's 20 or more contracts. Now the reason this is important, uh, this morning right before Trump came out and made the tweet that hey we're working on a new China deal. And right before NASDAQ had a 50 point spike in less than two minutes if you were in the room with us we were watching time and sales and we said hey look market's selling off however everything that's happening all the all the trades that are taking place on time and sales all the big orders are buyers only <clears throat> so if you look here this is what that looked like you can see here uh, from about 7 40 a.m until 8 51 it was nothing but buyers coming in and it was 25 contracts, 40 contracts, 68 contracts, 180 contracts, 184, 169, 118. So we saw a lot of big buyers coming in and there were really no sellers there. And then we had Trump come out just a couple minutes later, said, hey, we are have a new China deal. And all of a sudden you see NASDAQ pop by 50 points in less than two minutes. And this is what uh, I'm talking about right here. This was that 850. And you see, boom, we shot straight up. 50 points so uh, this is why time and sales are important they can kind of give us a, a hint as to where the market's going to be going where the big buyers and sellers are heading and trading but again that's how you set up time and sales i typically do about 20 contracts or more for most markets except for like the s p you want to adjust that uh for the s p instead of doing 20 contracts i do about 50 contracts or more but most things out there 20 or more is good and they'll tell you where all the big buyers and sellers people that are actually putting some some real money in their positions but that's it for today everybody i will see you all in the next video and until next time happy trading